guys welcome back if you're new here my name is Bernice and if you're a returning viewer thank you for watching so happy new year today is January 1st and I'm gonna be showing you guys my makeup and outfit for this new year's so let's get started here I'm gonna be drinking some wine while I'm doing my makeup so <laughs> let's see how that goes <clears throat> So to make this video a little bit faster, I'm going to leave all the products that I'm going to be using in the description box below. Also, to simulate yesterday, since it was such a busy day, um, this makeup is actually going to be pretty quick and easy. Well, at least easier than the last video because that was uh, actually took longer than I thought. <laughs> I'm going to start off with some primer. So after, after I let that primer sit on for a little bit, I'm gonna go ahead and use my concealer, some under my eyes. And also on the blemishes on my face, like this one right here, some over here. I also like to put some around my around my nostrils because I do have um, a different color around my lip area. Where'd it go? Ah, here it is. Well, I actually like to let my concealer sit for a little bit um, because it will provide you with more coverage. Um, I don't know, I saw this trick on TikTok to let your concealer sit for a bit and then start blending it out and I noticed that I had, I used less concealer when I let it sit for longer and it actually covered up more. So let's go with that sit. <laughs> okay guys. So now we're just gonna start blending. So I actually have a surprise for y'all. Um, I'm trying my hardest not to spill it right now. Because usually when I get people presents, I cannot keep my mouth shut. I'm like, do you want to know what I got you? It, every time. <laughs> and I want to say it so bad, but I can't. I'm, I'm going to wait. So after I finish blending my concealer out, I'm going to go ahead and put on my foundation. I have different beauty blenders. There's a concealer beauty blender and then there's the foundation one. I'm going to start blending that out. So whenever I want more of a natural look for my face, I like to put on the concealer under my foundation. Sometimes I contour under the foundation, but today I just wanted to do the concealer under. And I'm gonna put the contour on top. Like now I'm gonna be contouring my cheekbones. So put some here. I always like to go upwards. And I like to put it on top of my cheekbone, not exactly where it's starting. I used to do it before and then I noticed that it actually looks a lot better when I place it higher. And because all the pasta I've been having here, I'm actually going to have to put some under here. Make my face look a bit more snatched. And now I'm going to go ahead with my blush and put... Put that right on top of the contour. That. And I like to put some on my nose as well. So to blend all of this out, I'm going to use this angled brush and I'm going to spray it with my setting spray. And 
I like to use this brush because it hugs my cheeks really nicely. Well, for this look, I decided to do something a little bit easier with the eyes because usually for New Year's, um, at least myself, I really don't have that much of time to get ready. I tried to do something a little bit more simple. So now I'm gonna go ahead with a lighter concealer and just put this under my eyes. And just a little bit, I see. Eat that? <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna be blending that out. Now I'm going to set my face. So now I'm going to go ahead and set that cream contour with my powder bronzer. Round. Kind of go in circular motions. I do the same with my blush as well. I just found that it, it looks really nice. At least it looks nice and airbrushed. Now I'm gonna go ahead with that powder blush. So after I'm done with my contour, I'm gonna go ahead with my palette and I'm gonna do my eyebrows. I actually like to go with, not it's not too dark of a brown, but like this one, this is too dark. I like to go with this brown right here. Because, you know, we're gonna be partying sweating and all that. I'm going to use this fluffy brush. I'm going to put this on my brows. That way my brows will not be falling off <laughs> while we're dancing. I'm going to take the remaining of what I put on my brows and just put that all over. So to give my eyes some depth, I'm going to go ahead with that same color that I used on my brows. And I'm just going to put that on the space right above my crease just to give my eyes some depth since I'm not really doing too much. And now if the inside is a little bit too harsh on the nose, I like to take my baby blender and just dab it a little bit. There you go. Okay, now I'm gonna go ahead with this black. I think, which one's black? <laughs> Down here, I'm gonna go ahead with this black color. And I'm going to create an eyeliner, but all over my eye. So I'm gonna start off right here. And it doesn't have to be perfect because I'm actually going to end up smudging out the eyeliner that I make. And I'm going to put it under my eyes as well. I'm going to actually connect that eyeliner top to bottom. Also gonna put that same color on my waterline. I'm gonna take this smaller but fluffy brush as well 
And I'm just gonna, I don't know how to buff it out a little bit to give it a smoky look. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put on my half lashes. So I like to curl my lashes before I put on my lashes. I like to curl my lashes before I put on the fake lashes. Lashes are on. <laughs> okay. So, in order to blend my lashes and so they don't look like two separate lashes on, I'm going to go ahead and put on some mascara. So, now I'm going to put on some highlighter. So I'm actually going to do something a little bit different. I'm going to mix these two colors. I'm using this red and this hot pink in order to make a raspberry pink. Because I didn't want it. Since I already did red for, for Christmas, I just wanted to do something different. I just, you know, mixed it on my palette. Okay. Now to give that a little bit of pizzazz. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right word, but I'm actually gonna put on some lip oil. look like I have big juicy lips <laughs> okay so I'm gonna take my hair down and I'll be right back Hi guys, so that is the end of this video. If you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I hope that everybody has a great new year, a happy new year, and thank you. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.